Cell phones are something you usually keep close to you, but Dawn Ball had to put hers down to walk for breast cancer. That's when she says a thief walked right off with it. Dawn Ball went to Washington, D.C. to walk for breast cancer. She had raised more than $3,000 and was proud of her achievement. But when she put down her phone at what she thought was a safe place to participate in the walk, she was panic stricken to learn it was gone. I don't care about the phone. Phones can be replaced. What worried me was that I was going to lose all the pictures that I had taken while I was on the walk. She was elated when she learned an app on her cell phone had stored all of her pictures online and her memories were safe. But when she looked in her new phone, she saw more than she wanted to see. Pictures of the woman she believes stole her phone. She was taking a selfie and you could see her uniform with the patch of the security company that covered the walk for Susan G. Komen. Ball says the pictures add insult to injury, and the lewd photos we can't show you on television keep coming. And it's to the point that I can't have my, I can't let my children look on my phone. So because I can't, I'm afraid of what they'll see. Ball contacted the security company, but says they deny the woman in the phone works for them. I think she should lose her job. I don't think it's fair that she should still be working for a company that's supposed to be protecting people and their personal items. Ball says D.C. police were of little help in trying to track down the person who stole her cell phone because she doesn't live there. But from here on out, she's going to be more careful. In Covington, A.J. Walker, 9 on your side.